I did not expect this. <laughs> What's going on, guys? It's me and Teddy. Oh, uh, <laughs> we're not recording yet, so it's okay. You no, can just, uh, are you gonna wear shades? Imagine if we were all just in the back, just shades on. Shades on? <laughs> that would be fire. I'm not gonna lie. <sighs> oh yeah. Hey, what is that? Is that a can? No, that's a cup. It looks like a, yeah, it says Teji. That's the Teji that's sax nice. cup. Yeah, well, I've seen. I've definitely seen it. Probably illuminates in the. Uh, Mm. Drip. 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 <laughs> <laughs> what are we watching today? <laughs> <laughs> so today, guys, we're gonna be reacting, or I'm gonna be introducing you to the to the to the the world of Japanese music, specifically anime. Are we recording right now? We have been recording. For oh a while. yeah! Hell <laughs> yeah! <laughs> you never know. So it's like that. <laughs> yeah, guys. Oh, uh, you guys see that there are new people here. Names go. Hi. I'm Cole. Tanner. <laughs> What's up, y'all? Wait, were we doing it again for the top? <laughs> <laughs> so we have a bunch of my fellow friends, colleagues, music folk. They're going to be listening to Japanese music for the first time, specifically uh -huh. anime music. So who am I here with today? What's up? I'm Cole Tanner. And you're watching Disney Channel. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> what is up, y'all? My name is Niall Benjamin Bullock, AKA MB Talented. <laughs> <laughs> and this is Ryan Matthews. And you guys are all Musicians. Yes, yes sir. Yes. Musicians. Uh, I'm not a musician, I'm a mime. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I, I'm a singer and a songwriter, and I like to make music. I, I am also a singer and songwriter, and uh, I do a little bit of rap. I also act, and I like to dance, too. I am an engineer and producer, and uh, yeah. Facts. Yeah. 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 And if you guys want more information, you can find their bios down below. Yes. I'm going to put a bunch of different they're in, they're part of, and all their projects and everything that they do because they're awesome. So if you're watching this video, I mean, yeah. Tune in. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so today I'm going to be showing you guys anime music. Are you guys familiar with no. Japanese anime music? No. Never heard it very, before. very light. I've probably just heard the generic stuff. Generic yeah, stuff? Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Have you guys watched any anime? I, know, I tried to watch, but uh, Attack on Titan. Attack on yes. Titan? I started it. I probably got like, and I liked it. Yeah. And I tried to watch, uh, but I just stopped because I stopped watching things. Yeah. Same here. You saw me a little bit tag on Titan. I probably watched like three episodes into that. That's not I did watch a good amount of though. I started to watch the first. I need to go back and watch the that whole thing because I don't remember yeah. a lot. But Death Note was one, and that's that's kind of it. So, oh, Sword Art too. Oh, Sword Art Online? Oh shit. Bit. Okay, we got a veteran. <laughs> <laughs> I tried to read One Piece. Oh, I never watched how'd that one go? Piece. I didn't get very far. It's, it's a, a lot. It's, bro. it's, it's like a thousand series. episodes now. Yeah. It's the longest nice. series in history. There's so many really? books yeah. too. I'm lot. what you might call an anime normie. Nice. <laughs> Absolutely. I watched like half a season. I can't even remember the name, but it was this psychic guy with pink hair and he's at high school. Ooh, Psychic K. Yeah, oh. yes. Oh, that was, oh that's a great I have seen one. That. Yeah, that's a great yeah. one. I love I love this. That's actually really we should watch that. Mm -hmm. But yeah, man, I don't know what you guys expect. You guys have any expectations when it comes to what anime music or what's popular from anime music? I have an idea. It's usually like pretty epic, like rock okay. that just goes stupid. Some yeah. Hard, some hard ass cinematic yeah. stuff yeah. That, that we can sample. <laughs> ah, yeah. I, had, I had another idea. Uh -oh. I'm not going to tell y'all though. If we go through something and we like it, oh, yeah. definitely just say it. This is literally what we, this is what we do as artists. We listen, we love, we enjoy, but then we make and, then we drag and create. Through the mud. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> so this is gonna be exciting, man. If you're new to the channel, welcome. Yeah. If you want the full uncut reaction, make sure you go check out the Patreon down below. Um, without further ado, let's get into the first one. Just make sure you're uh, edible. I mean, seeable. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm edible. Wait, are you gonna tell us anything before you hit play? Hell no. <laughs> oh yeah. Hell no. <laughs> maybe the, maybe the artist. Okay, maybe the artist. If there is an artist. <laughs> No. So this is a song called I'm so Yo. Sorry. I'm figuring that, baby. I'm sorry, my friend. <laughs> this is a song from a um, anime called Jujutsu, Jujutsu Kaisen, oh, and yeah. it is a song called Kakai Katan by Eve. Uh, so we're gonna listen to the full version of this. <laughs> I'm 
shit. Shut up. you guys think man i have an interesting observation it's interesting to me just because i said earlier like i'm expecting like epicness mm -hmm. but like this like there's it's epic there's parts of it that are epic and certain sounds that are pretty epic but it sounds more emotional mm. Mm. while the visuals are pretty epic yeah but it yeah, sounds yeah. very emotional yeah, yeah. That's it's, it's less like yeah and more like yeah that switch up was I was not. <laughs> that, was crazy, yeah. nah, that caught me off guard the first time I heard yeah. it. I was like, whoa, whoa, whoa! Like, it sounded sound like a like a it sound like some stuff you would hear on the radio. I'm not mm. gonna lie. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I don't know where to start? <laughs> yeah, it's like a guy's journey. I would like yeah, to. Yeah, like that energy map of that song just was like up and down. It like took you. It would. It took you on a journey. Yeah, it was awesome. And I think the one thing that I've I've seen throughout opening themes is that they try to capture what's like the what the feeling of what's happening mm. at that time yeah. in the anime. I can see it with the even with the open like the just through the clips mm -hmm. like you know certain parts that would yeah. match up with the they with usually the do different openings per season right yeah so oh, that's crazy. So, so yeah the, so the, the, they'll change it up depending on the anime and the the uh, the mangaka the person who wrote the the manga and the studio they'll work in tandem and they'll like depending on what yeah what season or even if there's like an arc shift they'll change the entire like, opening I've known like yeah. some like you know yeah. comedy shows and certain certain like tv shows to do stuff like mm -hmm. that like but they won't do it every season like that's yeah that's great for them to yeah do it every season. yeah and like and, how many different things i mean there was this one anime and I, we're gonna we're gonna i'm gonna show you um an opening from that one called chainsaw man they had a new opening for every episode this no is way crazy. every single episode it was sweaty yeah. bro <laughs> <laughs> i mean <laughs> Yeah, man. Yeah, it's crazy. Oh, yeah. Oh, okay. I don't want to get too much into it. They put so much effort into the openings. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'll show you, but there's a lot of foreshadowing, what you'll notice. Oh, that's sick. There's a lot of foreshadowing in openings. Hmm. Um, sometimes even spoilers. Now, oh, if you're shoot. not if you're not keen about it, you won't notice it. Mm. Is that mainly just for like anime openings that kind of like yeah those Easter eggs? Yeah, they throw a lot. Like it's almost a stupid amount of Easter eggs. Like if you were to sit down and like pause at every moment. That's so funny because <laughs> like in the song itself, it's like. Like, when I was listening to that, it's, like, everything that you could ever want to hear in a song. It's, like, at some point, it's, like, they did. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. And it was yeah. the producer moment or the breakdown. Uh -huh. And I feel like that goes in tandem with, like, if you 
if you listen close enough or you look close enough, you can figure uh-huh. out like the entire thing. Yeah, exactly, exactly. Thing. It was almost overly like saturated isn't the right word, mm-hmm. but it, like it felt good how much like extra stuff there was yeah. in there. So an- another thing to that point, this entire song is not used for the opening. Right, they only they only use a part of it. Oh, I think because they only you know yeah, they yeah. only need like one minute. You know what I mean? Just like yeah. get the energy up for everyone. <laughs> and I'm not entirely sure if this song was made for this anime, but sometimes you'll see that like they bring in like artists personally and say, "Hey, we will, wait, we want you to make this song for this anime." And it'll, it'll release with the anime, yeah, um, and things like that. But but there are other times, and we, we may not get to it today. But they'll uh, most of the, like a good amount of time they'll actually use songs that already exist. Feels like if it's the theme, then they're gonna for use it for opening. That is insane for artist promo. Yeah, that's yeah. that's crazy. I word. So now we're getting to we're gonna go uh, listen to the Chainsaw Man. It's called Kickback. Okay. Uh, this is definitely gonna be. Well, I'm not gonna say anything, but. <laughs> This is the uh, the anime version. <laughs> <laughs> Stupid hard. Yeah. It was harder than Flintstone. City hard. I'm like, I'm yeah. Lying. So that's the opening for um, one of the biggest animes of this year. Yeah, I remember. I remember um, crazy yeah, stuff about it's this. Uh, definitely highly regarded as one of the best new gen animes. Um, and I gotta ask. I'm sorry. Mm-hmm. Is the one with the dog? Connected to the same, like the chainsaw dog, we lead a series. Oh, you know what the, I'm one, about? the one you saw oh, here? The chainsaw, chainsaw dog. Oh, like the, the one with the pup? Yes, something? yeah, that's here. Yeah. Uh, that's yeah. the same, uh-huh. same show? Oh, okay. Same show, same show, yeah. Have you ever seen like Pochita? That's yeah. His, that's his name. Okay. Uh, yeah. So this was a little more funky, I, oh, I'd yeah. say, you know, compared to like. Just for that bass line, yeah. I was like, yeah, yeah. I like how they combined like the, the Amen break. Like, yeah, yeah. 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 They pull from, from so many from different genres. Yeah, yeah. There's like EDM and like math rock. Yeah. yeah. Also, there. just like drum and bass straight up. Yeah, yeah. Like drum and bass and EDM. And I don't know if you also, you know, this, this, this guy is crazy, but each of these scenes here was from a very famous film called Pulp Fiction. Oh, no way. No shit. <laughs> they just follow the concept. Mm-hmm. Like, the, their influences are influenced. Like, that's one of my favorite films. I love that. Yeah, Fiction. I haven't I actually watched it. I haven't seen it. Yeah, yeah. I've yeah. seen clips so many times. I've yeah. seen parodies, bro. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. It's crazy. It's crazy how much like these the these mangas and studios can just throw into openings. They they really have creative freedom when it comes to that's pretty crazy. Opening. And they don't run into any like copyright issues. Um, I'm sure they talk with <laughs> <laughs> talk with folks. You know, have a little um, sit down. I mean, <laughs> I'm gonna run into a copyright issue with this <laughs> video. Those yeah. visuals. Art were confusing. Like, yeah. I was like, what is going on? What is this? Okay, what the? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Fighting or whatever. The effects on the show, too, the animation mm-hmm. looks, looks crazy. Like, yeah, it's, it's super well it's animated. It's so surreal, yeah. but it's amazing. Yeah, it's super well uh, check this one animated. Out. Yeah, a lot of people were saying that they didn't love the animation because they use a CGI, mm. which is a. A touchy subject in the anime community. Because it's usually drawn. Yeah, most of it is um, drawn. But then we're also like, we don't want these um, animators to like be slaving 120 hours. Right, which, right. Like for oh oh, and also by the way, this 
anime and the last one are all animated by the same studio. Same dude. I could like the same, same like the same hundred people are editing. All I can see stuff. like little. That's little crazy. Shows. Yeah, yeah. You know, like a thousand. I don't know how many people they have, but yeah. That's so, a lot of work. So yeah, yeah so bro. there's like there's this ongoing joke <laughs> about um, the studio is called Mappa, mm-hmm. Mappa, and there's an ongoing joke online about how Mappa keeps on taking more and more projects because they are technically the best right now, mm-hmm. but like pretty much the animators are like getting no sleep. Yeah, yeah. sounds like, like this. Like they're, I mean, they're literally like sleeping at their, like they're working, bro. Oh, yeah. You should hire more <laughs> animators. <animals. laughs> yeah. you know, Protect yeah. those men's mental headspace. Yeah, physical. man. The demand for anime is so, so much now, especially mm-hmm. in the Western world. Mm-hmm. But anyway, we're going to move on to Attack on Titan. Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah. Let's go. This is Attack on Titan. <laughs> this is also at, uh, animated by Mappa. Okay. <laughs> we love you, Mappa. We really do. So, yeah. Let's get a... Uh, oh! Let's, <laughs> let's get into it. something dawned on me in the middle of that and I was like no other t- like show that's not anime has like that some serious music behind it you know what uh, I mean? yeah. Yeah. like some show can do that like yeah. you know regular shows that we commonly watched growing up as kids mm. just like, didn't have the energy this, yeah. this yeah. music yeah. you know like real yeah. music like you were saying before there's that emotion behind it yeah. it's so hard to find in music yeah, yeah. bless what in tears was put into that that, thing. Yeah. that, that shit bro yeah. they, they'll be the hard we'd be having the hard catchy Childhood jingles and like regular mainstream TV. Mm. This is this is like this yeah. is really an anthem. People people consider this anthems. Yeah. A lot of, yeah. a lot of anime music is considered like like oh okay yeah this is you go hard you know the metal I mean? part bro I mean like it's uh, so I crazy mosh. It's so different. Like you were saying, it's so different from just like mainstream Western music that you yeah. hear in like mm. you know regular TV shows or movies. Again, like anime music so like in demand. Mm. People literally they hear it once and they're like. Add it to the playlist. Or, yeah, <laughs> you or, know? And I think it also does a great job of just, um, like, setting up, like like, like, we, like we were saying earlier, like, setting up the, the, the mood of whatever you're about to watch. You yeah. know what I mean? So, like, if you, you hear that, you're like, okay, I'm getting excited. Or, you know, it's going to be awesome. And, and like, like, like we were talking, most shows do have opening music, but, yeah, I guess nothing like... <laughs> I, yeah, I, I really, I don't really know. I don't really know, like, any songs or any opening themes that I would add to my playlists, you know? Really try to think, I'm trying to like, think about... Like maybe the Office theme, but... I don't <laughs> <know>. <laughs> 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 I'm trying to think about my favorite show to watch. It's probably like Curb. Curb? Yeah. <laughs> like how you don't work. That Proud Family theme song. That would have. That's a great that, one. That one went crazy as <laughs> well. Drake and Josh. Drake and Josh. Drake and Josh. What is that one about? I'll never find that it means so similar. I fell away. I fell away. That was different also because like that was yeah. him in the show. Thanks. Oh, like, true. Like, oh, maybe Robot Chicken. <laughs> <laughs> um, for instance, this song was created for this. 
like mm-hmm. for this scene. I mean, the rumbling. I'm not gonna talk about anything about Attack on Titan, but this specifically was made for Attack on Titan, mm. um, and then became popular because of Attack on Titan. And now people go to their concerts to hear this song. That's, that's crazy, crazy. <laughs> bro. What? That's crazy. That's so I imagine that's they, crazy. so. Is it is it one band, one artist that does all the songs for Attack on Titan? No, so, no, bro. Imagine if they did like Attack on Titan music festival, and it's all the <laughs> bands that have that songs. would be crazy. That would they do have cool. performances, um, like they have performances of like some of the like the popular openings. Mm. Like they've had those before. <sighs> Um, they'll have like full orchestras. Oh, a, I, I can I can show y'all. So I mean, cool. yeah, we'll, we'll see if we might get to that. All right. Next <laughs> up, we have uh, Black Clover. Black Clover, Black Clover opening. Um, this is opening you three. This, one. this is blowing Good my boy. expectations away. Yeah, so really. Far. Yeah. That's awesome, bro. I'm it's glad crazy. To it's crazy shit. The production quality is just like through the roof. Yeah. Oh yeah, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, the Japanese do not play <laughs> with their with a lot of this, especially like the animation, but the music itself, bro. Uh, we can later on we can get into some of the soundtracks. Mm-hmm. Oh, y- y'all, y'all don't even know, bro. I I can't even lie. All right, let's get into Black Clover. This is opening three. <laughs> I, I don't, I don't know how they did this, but every time I expected something to happen musically, yeah. the opposite. Yeah, exactly. Whole different direction. Exactly. <laughs> exactly. Whole different direction. Yeah, I don't know how they direction. did that. Yeah, really. that's crazy. They used like reverse psychology. It was yeah. so weird. It made my brain work. <laughs> and then when the hook came in, I was like, oh. Yeah, shit. now you're all like trying to. Whoa. Yeah. Um, yeah. Specifically, this anime in particular uh, is regarded as has oh, probably one like the most rated or highly rated anime openings of all the time. Mm-hmm. Like, I can show you pretty much. They have 13. You probably say the same thing about 10 of them. They mm-hmm. they, they really threw everything. Like, it's amazing what they did with this anime, mm-hmm. um, which is why it became so popular. But um, definitely one of my favorite openings. This is opening three. I was not supposed to show you this. <laughs> <laughs> no, I was, I was, I was, I was. Is the band Black Clover? No, the band for this is uh, Vico, oh, Vico Blanca. Vico Blanca. Vico Blanca. Yeah, they're, they're highly regarded. They've done a couple of other ones. Um, yeah, yeah, what was yeah. what was the one that you... Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Well, I sampled? Yeah, which one was that? That was an ending, I think. That one was beautiful. Oh, and it's, it was an ending. Goodness! Oh, goodness oh, wow. gracious! Wow! <laughs> Your beard was booming, bro! <laughs> Welcome back to Tennessee. 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 So, Tennessee. That cover looks crazy. Yeah. yeah. So this is um ending nine of Chainsaw Man. <laughs> Sorry. I'm so sorry. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's so 
Ascended. I was I was high fiving Jesus there. <laughs> I got you, son. That's cool. Um, it just took me wait. to a place. Yeah, it was. Uh, yeah, what, what did you guys? Uh, what did you guys think about that? That ending? Uh, they just they keep getting better. They keep better. hitting. Keep hitting. It's an ending. It's an ending. It's an ending. It's an ending. Is that the one that you messed around with, or is that just a random? I have messed around with this. This one? Yeah. I like that. Yeah, yeah that's, that's, cool. that's, that's an easy one to sample. Yeah, that is some crazy <laughs> person. You can use that really well. Um, yeah. Yeah, that progression goes stupid. Tight. Right, giving, giving them ideas. We're gonna do we'll one kick. more. This is a super popular um, ending by Jujutsu Kaisen. Well, before we get to that, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed. If uh, if you want to see the boys back. <laughs> Drop the drop your pants. <laughs> she said, "No, I can't, bro. I can't do this." But fact, drop a like. Um, drop a like. I'll drop a like, and I'll maybe. And let us and let us know. <laughs> maybe from here. And let us know if you come back. Let us know what you want to see down below. Um, if you have the feeling uh, to move a little, go ahead right ahead with this one. Did you see? What? <laughs> This is not what I expected. If you gon' do it, then who can you know to get? Yeah, everybody just talk, nobody really do it. Now I'm not a yard of my dish, don't feel any to me. Got a couple cut to me and not the field, you pull no jack, you don't get the break. Hard fit. It's like Kai. Yeah, Kai. Yeah, Kai. Yeah, Laker colors. <laughs> on this one how it's yeah. like like looks sloppy <laughs> <laughs> looks bad it was like, <laughs> it was like a nintendo dsi yeah no. yeah yeah kind of animation almost it was so specific it was, DSI. it was hard though it was yeah. hard and everybody came out vibing. Yeah, yeah, this was like, yeah. yeah. This this was a super super popular one when it came out. I don't know if you can notice like the people that were vibing, mm -hmm. but they kind of I don't know exactly what they did, but they took actual dancers and then they oh, put animation on top like of the, it. Yeah, oh. that's why it looks so fluid. Like, that's oh, yeah. I was gonna. That's another thing I was gonna say was how did they anim <laughs> like draw that. Yeah, to be that it, it, it's super it's fluid. fluid. Yeah, yeah, that's you know, nice. Like, that's really yeah. unique. That's just really dope. I like that. That might be one of. Uh, I saw a whole bunch of crazy animation, but, but just before that concept, Honestly. That, you know, that might be one of my top favorite. animations. I haven't even watched this, but like in so, the yeah. opening, that's, that's yeah. crazy. That's awesome. It's just so smooth too. I didn't expect oh. the boogie disco to come yeah, out. Yeah, right. <laughs> he really threw us a curveball after like the death metal. And like, yeah. yeah, yeah, no, it was, it was definitely one of those things. And that's the thing, like, the, there's like there's like a ton of variety. Oh, one so thing like, I learned today. Yeah, right. <laughs> expectations were exceeded. Yeah, for real. Ding! <laughs> Definitely. For real. <laughs> yeah. How about you guys? Same. Uh, in, in terms of the for, music. For real. I didn't expect it to be, be like that diverse yeah, when, yeah. It, when it came to the openings and the th and, and 
and even like the, the different types of animation mm -hmm. styles and especially all of that coming from is this done by the same Mappa? people is this done by Mappa too so yeah so this was done by Mappa that's crazy the other one was um, the only one that wasn't done by Mappa was the Black Clover one okay. Okay. everything else was Mappa that's crazy for that to be kind of like all different artists that th that's that's pretty insane yeah. that shows yeah. you the reach and creativity and talent that's over there I definitely yeah. came into it expecting like Ryan said like you know the epic drums and stuff yeah. that's what I've heard but you know there's so many different like they were they're so influenced by so many different genres yeah, it's fact. so cool it's, it's, it's crazy I mean we heard so much respect disco jazz funk yeah it's like some real. dubstep in there <laughs> like, dubstep, EDM. Yeah, dubstep man. EDM drum and bass yeah they're, they're, they're hip to a lot yeah um, yeah. <laughs> yeah I can see you know that. and I didn't, uh, I didn't expect that my my uh understanding of it was pretty uh, naive yeah, yeah for real coming was, into this i was now. thinking super epic the whole time yeah. like themes i felt like i was bumping mm -hmm. the playlist on shuffle type thing you know? let's yeah. go we yeah. did it guys yeah. <laughs> now i gotta go home and actually watch maybe once we get like another channel where we react to uh, episodes you know what I'm saying let us know but yeah man um there's a lot more that I would love to show you guys, but today was just the tip of the iceberg, mm -hmm. but I hope this gave you a taste. Absolutely. Oh, yeah. of what, it, what it is and why I appreciate it so much and why yeah. a lot of people. Yeah. Scoop. It really was. I appreciate <laughs> it I so much more. 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 I, yeah. more. I, want more. I want more. I want a ton. <laughs> so drop a like so I can Heck have yeah. more. Facts. Drop Facts. a like so we can come back. Subscribe to my boy. If you don't, that's okay, but. <laughs> 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 I was going to say something out of pocket, but I can't do that. Other Facts. Shit. And please go check out their music, guys. We have a release date coming out, single dropping on March 31st. Yes, sir. March 31st. Whenever this comes out, it'll uh, be before then. Cole so Music. check out Cold Tanner Music down below. MB Talented down below. RMP down below. Yes. Very Go easy down. To find your address. <laughs> <laughs> There's the out of pocket shit. Cut! <laughs> Cut! <laughs> I can't believe you've done this. Till next time. <laughs>